Hi viewers, welcome back to Siri Algorithms YouTube channel. Please like, share and subscribe my channel. In my previous video, I explained up to bitwise XR. Now in this video, I am going to explain the bitwise shift operators. So bitwise shift operators plays a crucial role when working with the binary data and optimizing certain operations. So there are majorly two types of um, bitwise shift operators, bitwise left shift and bitwise right shift. So first uh, I will show you the program, then I will explain the logic behind the bitwise shift operators. So please walk through with me, let me show you the code. So, so first uh, bitwise left shift operator, the representation is like this. And uh, I'm going to assign an integer value to variable a is equal to 16. Now I'm writing like a print statement. I'm going to shift the integer value 60 two bits towards to the left side. Let's execute and see. Now the output is 240. If I shift uh, the integer value 60, Two, 2 bits towards to the left side, the output is 240. How I got that 240? The logic I will explain it now. So, let's take the integer value 60. Please wait a moment. So, A is equal to 60. The general left shift, uh, bitwise left shift representation is like this. And the general form of bitwise left shift is x representation 2 bits. So this is n. So x is nothing but value. Which value you want to shift? So the value comes as a x here. And uh, this is the representation of left shift. This is the general representation of left shift. And n is nothing but uh, number of bits. How many number of bits you want to move? That is the n here. So first uh, let's convert this number, integer number to binary format. So let's take uh, 60 to 30. The remainder is 0. 215 your reminder 0, 27 your 14 reminder is 1, 23 your 6 1, 21 your 2 1. Let's write the binary number for 60 here. So 1 1 1 1 0 0. Total it is 6 bits but binary number always it is 8 bits. So add 2 bits towards to the left side. And now this is the binary number of 60. Just let make a small box here. So I am just uh, drawing like a boxes. Now I am going to shift uh, 2 bits towards to the left side. So... You can see it here. I am moving the bits. So first two bits are going to be discarded. Because these two bits discarded. Then the bits are going to shifted here. The first one here. And the second shift to here. And this comes here. And this bit here. And this zero here. And this 0 comes here. Now it is total 6 bits. Now I am going to add 2 bits towards to the right side. So what I done here. I just discarded 2 bits into the left side. And added 2 bits towards to the right side. This is the bitwise left shift. Now we are going to write the bits here. 2 to the power of 0 means 1, 2 to the power of 1 means 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64 and 128. 
let's add all the numbers wherever we have the one so these four numbers just add it 128 plus 64 plus 32 plus 16 total it is 240 this is the integer number of 240 the same it is the binary number of 240 if you want to confirm it whether this uh, this is binary number of 240 or not just take like a 240 to 120 remainder is 0 2026 jar 12 remainder 0 230 remainder 0 and uh, 21 jar 2 25 jar 10 remainder 0 27 jar 14 remainder 1 23 jar 6 remainder 1 21 jar 2 1 now let's write the binary number here so the binary number of 240 is 11110000 just check it once both are same or not so both are equal so when you shift the integer number 60 two bits toward to the left side left shift the output is 240 this is the logic behind the shifting let me show you one more example if i want to shift four bits if you want you can shift the eight bits 16 bits that's up to you so let me take same value a is equal to 60 and i'm going to shift four bits print of a left shift of four bits now you can see the value is 960 if you want to shift eight bits just here it is nothing but n the general form of shift wise operators the first a is nothing but a value here and this is the representation of left shift and n is nothing but number of bits you want to shift so maybe i want to shift eight bits now you can see 15360 the value now bit wise right shift operator the representation like this now i'm going to assign a value to variable for example a is equal to 60 now i'm going to shift two bits towards to the right side so a this is the representation of right shift on two bits so let's execute and see now the output is 15 so if i uh, the integer value of 60 if i move two bits towards to the right side the output is 15 how i got this 15 let me explain the logic uh, in manual way so let me open the paint first so now let's take the value integer value a is equal to 60 here the right shift representation is like this this is right shift and uh, the general way of writing bit wise right shift operator x towards to the right shift and n here so x is nothing but value whatever the value you assigned to a variable that is nothing but x here and n is nothing but number of bits you want to move so here so first let's convert the 60 into binary format so 60 so already i explained in my previous video okay i will show you again so the remainder is 0 215 remainder 0 27 remainder is 1 23 remainder 1 21 remainder 1 let's write the binary number for 60 here it is 1 1 1 1 0 0 let's write two zeros into the left side so this is the total binary number of 60 so let's take a small box here 
uh, let's change the color so here it is the binary representation so now i'm going to shift towards to the right side so i'm taking a new box here so the first two bits here here in the right side those going to be discarded the, the these two bits are going to be discarded then the shifting one comes here and this one comes here this one comes here and this one into here and zero comes here and this zero comes here and i'm going to add two zeros towards to the left side here so i discarded two bits into the right side and added two bits towards to the left side whether it is a positive number or it is a negative number always the bits added is zero only so now i'm going to write the bits here 2 to the power of 0 means 1 2 to the power of 1 means 2 2 square means 4 8 16 32 64 128 let's add wherever you have the 1 those numbers you take and add it here so those are nothing but 8 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1 so the total number is 12 13 14 15 so the output is 15 here so this is the integer number of 15 the same this is the binary number of 15 let's make it confirmation let's take and um, take the 15 and convert into a binary format 2 7 jar 14 reminder is 1 2 3 jar 6 reminder 1 2 1 jar 2 1 so write the numbers here 1 1 1 1 only 4 bits let's add the remaining 4 bits towards to the left side so this is the binary representation of integer value of 15 let's compare it here and here so both are equal so when we shift the 60 integer value of 60 2 bits towards to the right side the output is 15 let me show you one more program here so if i shift 60 towards 4 bits maybe i am going to shift 4 bits towards to the right the output is 3 you can take any value here not only 60 you can take a is equal to 135 and i am going to shift 2 bits towards to the right side a 2 bits the output is 33 so thank you in my next video i am going to explain the assignment operators and please don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you see you in next video